Hey, what's up, everybody? It is January 10th, I think. Somewhere around there. It's about 3.30 in the afternoon. I'm out in this lake. Gonna try to catch some nice bluegills, maybe a crappie, maybe a walleye. Who knows? I'm fishing the edge of a basin here. It's not bad outside. It's like 15, but the wind's blowing pretty good. <clears throat> I'm tucked back in off around this corner of this little island here. Before I get this video rolling, what I want you guys to do is go download the fish donkey app okay and then enter the anna and nicole nicole anna versus you vice versa um fishing tournament on the fish donkey app it's all walleyes it runs from january 15th to like 31st i think you'll have to look but i'm entering here in the next couple days gonna get out try and get a couple walleyes in that tournament it's gonna be a fun tournament i mean it's dirt cheap to enter and you can win all kinds of prizes, seriously. But uh, yeah, I'm going to try to... Actually, I, th I should be able to find the, the link for Fish Donkey somewhere. And I'll put it in the description of this video. Go to that. Enter that thing. And get it done. Yeah. Anyway, I'm going to get some rods in the hole. Try and get us some bluegills or something here. Alright, you guys. First thing I'm going to do is get myself a tip down in the water. Two feet right here. Okay. Putting a big minnow on this thing. I don't want to mess around. That's little baby stuff. I'm looking for Mr. Donkey. So when tip down is down, that minnow's probably two feet off the bottom. Go up a little bit more. Okay. <clears throat> Mainly in the fish house when I'm running the tip down is I don't let it drop all the way down because I'm sitting here. As soon as I see a fish bite and it starts going down, I just grab it. I said I could run a bobber on it, but I don't, you know, I don't want to deal with a slip knot being on my line the entire time. Tip down, you ain't got to worry about that. All right, got some fish on the screen down here. They could be, uh, they could be perch, they could be bluegills, who knows. They're definitely chasing my minnow around though. Let's see if we can pick one off. <clears throat> Ooh, there's a fish on this one over here. Fish on this. Gosh, it's a big perch, you guys. Holy crap. Wow. That's a really big perch. I don't know, probably a 10 inch or anyway. Big fur around here. He's fishing little blood worms. That's what they're eating out here in this mud. See that? It's like little blood worms right on bottom. That's what these guys are doing out here. So essentially what I should do is I should put down a red spike. But I don't have any, so that's not going to happen. Also bluegills sitting on the bottom down there. <clears throat> Go. Another bluegill bet. 
go. Another beauty. These fish out here are just built like a tank. The profile on them. Man. This chunky. Whoa. Yo, dude, get back in the water. Get this back down there. Maybe switch into this four mil was the ticket. I don't know. I'll give one nice little bite. Oh, it's perch, huh? Huh. It's a nice school of bluegills that came through there. interested while I get back to home. slow to be a walleye maybe. Oh my gosh, big old bluegill you guys. Big old bluegill. Look at that. Oh, that's a fish I've been looking for. Big old beautiful, I don't know, play nine and a half incher. go. Big Daddy go. Oh. Yep, here comes one. Got him. Here we go. Big bluegill. Yep. Big bluegill. Guys, there we go. Oh. Oh. Jeez, look at the profile on these things. They're so big. Just ridiculous. these fish are. <clears throat> Seems like on this lake that lasts 45 minutes before dark the big bluegills come alive and start chowing.
beauty. Come on there, bud. Oh, you got my wax arms too. There you go, Holmes, I'll let you go. Got him. Big bluegill, you guys. Big, 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 big. Gonna be the biggest of the night, I'll bet. It took him a while to come up and bite it, but I think it's gonna be a big one. Giant. Absolute giant. Look at that. Giant fish right there, you guys. Man, it took him a while. I don't gosh, I don't have my I don't have my my bump board, but man, that's gotta be close to ten inches. Maybe more. But that's a ten inch fish. He's gone. But he bit. Some coaxing, holy crap. Of course, my wax worms don't look that pretty. Big fish. Got him. Another big fish, you guys, I'll bet. Good size, anyway. Man, the mark looked really big on the. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice fish. Nice fish, you guys. Oh, yeah, another, another beautiful, big old donkey size bluegill. Look at those things. Big male. Male have the big ear tab, females have the smaller ear tab. Big bull released again. crappie action baby right there nothing not a huge one but nonetheless it's a nice crappie Let's see if these I'm gonna drop my thing down here come on might as well eat it you're there already Got him. Another line out of the hole. Another nice bluegill. Yep. <laughs> Man. I love those big bluegills, you guys. Get that fella back down there. Gosh, there's something. There's a bunch more down there. I don't know if those are crappies or what they are. <clears throat> I'm going to try to get down here and find out here though I want to get that minnow back down but with fish on the graph right now I'm just going to get down here and see if I can get him to bite oh got one looking right now last one that was on the screen it's crawling up crawling up Got him. There we go. The last one that was on the screen there. Uh -huh. It is too. It's a decent, probably eater. Seven, seven incher. All right. What's up, everybody? Well, it is almost dark out. Might not look like it outside, but it is almost dark out. Um, caught some really nice bluegills here late this evening. Like I said, I didn't get out, I didn't get my house set up till almost probably quarter to four, you know. <clears throat> you come out here in the daytime, it's really just a, a waste of time. You do get some big perch, 
um, which I did in this video too. I got a few. I'm not going to show you all of them. But I got some nice perch in this video. Big bluegills. 22 feet of water we're in. Um, we're just around a, the edge of a basin. Once again, you see, you see me guys, I, I basin fish a lot. You know, I only um, weed fish in dirtier lakes. It's a pretty clear looking lake. But uh, anyway, <clears throat> before I let you guys out of here, like I said, I'm going to try to put the link to the Nicole and Anna versus you. Not the link, but the, I'll put the app link down below for the fish donkey. But go sign up for that tournament. It's like 10 bucks, I think. You know, and you can win all kinds of awesome prizes. I said that at the beginning of the video, but I'm going to implore you to go do it again. It's 10 bucks. You know, you waste that at a gas station buying beef jerky one day. Anyway, equipment I'm using tuned up custom rods, precision noodle, things money. PC Fun ICX, ICX5 reel. I'm using four pound test too, by the way. A lot of people ask me what I'm using. Um, got my reels all taped to my rods now. Right here. Got my tuned up custom rods, bris, or uh, bull whip. Then my dead stick rod on my tip down here for crappies and everything else lately. Sullivan tip down, money, money, Mark Malik 7. Strike Master Light Flight. I like telling you guys what I use, you know. Yeah. Anyway, um, oh yeah, of course my jigs, man. Good for my jigs, the ones I've been using. I've used two three millimeter jigs made by Alex or Panfish Pirates. Awesome colors on these jigs, you guys. Go over, check them out. Of course, his link will also be in the description of this video. There'll be a bunch of links in the description. Go check it out. Thank you guys for watching. Please uh, like, share, subscribe, and smash that notification button.